Oh, I can't remember which coffee was mine. Mine was that one. Yeah, mine tastes like a nice coffee. Got my blueberry muffin. Oh, it's been a while since I've been on these cameras. That. Oh, yeah. Right, let's go. We're going to Tully's. Oh, my God. Tunnel. We're here, but we've got a few hours until we can check into our Airbnb. So we're gonna just wander around. Let's go. We've arrived in our Airbnb. I'll do a little room tour. It's essentially just like an apartment, but it's super cute and it's like just overlooking like the castle. So there's like a lovely little sit down area outside. She's left us like granola and coffee. So cute. We've gone for like a little explore around Lewis, which was so cute, but we're gonna properly do it tomorrow. <laughs> But what I want to show you is we went into a bookshop that you would have seen and they had a blind date with a book. And I just think this is the cutest thing ever. It was only four pounds and it's basically just like all wrapped up like this. And then you got to pick, it said, this one was a friendship, escapism, quirky and enchanting. And this is the one I went for because some of them, there was another one that was like sexy, which obviously got a bit of spice in it, but it also had thriller and thriller just scares me. Even though the next read I'm gonna be reading is a thriller. However, I'm gonna open it. Should I open it now? Okay. Chris, it's just one of the books you've already got. No, they didn't have the book. Like, they, there wasn't a romance <laughs> section in that bookshop. I'm scared. <gasps> Wait. Yeah. Oh my god, don't you get a bookmark as well? Melanie Rose. It's a romance. Oh my god. Okay. Freak snowstorm leaves a young woman stranded and unconscious. Coming to who she has no recollection of who she is and how she got there. She awakes in an idyllic country cottage belonging to Vincent, a dashing city banker. I'm very happy with my choice. Context of this book, tearjerker, thrills, drama, love, sex. Brilliant. <laughs> I'm so excited. I may be swayed to a thriller. I'm only on chapter three, but guys, I'm, I'm hooked. Okay, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna give you a little apartment tour. The door, I'm up against the door, okay? Come in. Put your coats there. This is the... We've actually shut the curtains because we can see like to the road, which we didn't really have people looking, so we've shut those curtains. Um, again, I think, yeah, just cute little bed. And then this is what I think she's so cute. She's like put fresh granola and coffee for the more coffee and tea for the morning. So cute. Some copper pipe for Jack. <laughs> The bathroom is in here and then 
My favourite part, guys, is this. Ready? So that is essentially. Oh, um, hang on, it's on the Airbnb thing. Let me find it. There you go. That is essentially it, but it's just so cute and perfect for us for just tonight. But first, I'm gonna um, just freshen up and get ready because we're going to Tellys tonight. We're actually very scared. I think both of us were saying when we were out for lunch that like, we're, no, I think there's two new. I think there's two new mazes, which will be great. But we've never gone with just us two. We've always gone like a big group, and you're in safety in numbers when you're at Tully's, and we're not. So Jack's gonna have to look after me. <laughs> right. We are back from Tully's. Oh my gosh. I'm shattered. Jack. Jack lying on the bed. We went, how, how many years ago did we say it was? Six. We've been twice. So we went, we went with my friends from East 15 the first year. And then we went back with some other some more of our friends the following year so we I think we worked it out that it was 2018 everything's different like there are like three there are like a few that were the same but a lot of the mazes like they've changed um I don't even know if I've even said in this vlog that we were going to go to Tully's. I can't even remember now. But yeah, it was so fun. I think we ended up making a list and like ticking off the ones that we hadn't done first. And there's two new ones. There was Purgatory and oh, what was it called? The Carvings. Oh my God. And that ended up being my favourite. It was so good. I can't get this out. Oh wow. Wonderful. And that ended up being my favourite. It was so good. I was screaming so much. My throat hurt. So we just went to Tesco to get an orange juice because we're going to sit and have some orange juice and watch some Grey's Anatomy now. <sighs> what an evening. I would definitely recommend. <laughs> I literally look like one of the people that scare you in the maze. Um, but I would definitely recommend. I think we were both a little bit nervous because we've always gone in a big group and it was just us two but actually it was so fun we got around them all like so quickly I think there was just three that we didn't do because they were the ones that we'd done before we wanted to do all the ones that we hadn't done before um so yeah I think there was three in the end that we didn't do I would probably say to get a fast track pass but I reckon like I reckon the longest we queued for was like 40 minutes 30 minutes yeah, I'd probably say like 30 minutes here. Hang on. And that was for the new one. So I'd probably say get that one out of the way first because as the night went on, if you're gonna go, as the night went on, that one, I think it was purgatory, the queue was like getting like longer and longer. People queuing for like an hour to get onto it. But it was because you can't like have too many people go round at, at the same time. Yeah, the carving one was my favourite. We were just going around it ourselves and it was just so funny. Oh, it was so fun. I definitely recommend. But yeah, taking the makeup off. Gonna get in bed. Watch Grey's Anatomy. And live my best life. If no one, I'm just presuming everyone knows what Tully's is, but I've just realised you might not. And it's basically a scare festival that there's like loads of attractions of like different scare mazes, different activities. Um, to do all around Halloween and it's just brilliant oh wow my hair just yeah I didn't I mean I didn't really put it up properly did I <laughs> I kept doing this <laughs> oh my god it was crazy oh it was so scary
in my car, in my bag, sorry. Good morning, hello. We have just checked out of our little Airbnb and we're going for a little wander. We've parked our car in this little, little car park all day, so we have time to wander. Absolutely loved this morning. Jack slept in a little bit, but I just read my book and it was lovely and fresh outside and oh, it was just lovely. But I think it's gonna be another nice day today. All the autumn vibes and yeah, I don't know if you can see here, but there's like a little castle and everything's like all stone and lovely. Um, but what did you think of Tully's last night? It was really good. It was really so good. fun. So fun. What was your favourite one? Um, what was it called? The carving. Yeah, I said the that same. Because it was so long and it was like a little bit inside and then outside. And then this guy was like chasing us with the chains. <laughs> I suppose the one that scared me the most though was the, the new one that they've done. The... Purgatory. Purgatory, yeah, that oh. was not my cup of tea. There's like mirrors and... It's a dark strobe lights and then there's like <laughs> terrifying nuns chasing you. Oh my God. Um, terrifying. Yeah, that was not my favourite. That one, it was the one that scared me the most, mm. but I was yeah. actually scared. <laughs> I was yeah. like... <laughs> oh, it is now the next day. Jack and I literally have had the best time. I'm just sad that it wasn't longer. I don't even know where I left this vlog, but we essentially just wandered around Lewis for the rest of the afternoon, went into some shops. I found some really nice jeans from a charity shop. Um, we just went for lunch. The Airbnb um, had like a list of restaurant recommendations. So we ended up going to like this pizza place and it was so good. Um, and yeah, we just literally had the best time. I'm just sad it wasn't longer. Tully's was brilliant, never lets me down. Yeah, and I'm, I'm so glad we went because we had such, such a laugh. I've got a little bit of work to catch up on today. No rest for the wicked, just a few little reels that I want to film and obviously edit this video so I can get it out for you. Um, I'm sorry it just wasn't longer. Like, I feel like I was trying to chill and have like a holiday but also I wanted to film because I feel like I always just vlog the same stuff. So I was like, I want to just film our trip away because it's actually a little bit more interesting than what I do get up to on a day to day. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. It's just nice to do something and get out, get out of the usual routine. Come out to the supermarket to get a few ingredients for the reels that I'm going to be filming. I think that's essentially it for next week. Yeah, so thank you so much for watching if you got this far and I will start a new vlog tomorrow for next week. So I will see you then. Have a lovely week. Bye.